行ってみよう Alright, what is good, y'all? Johan here to bring you my Hero Fest ticket summons and free summons for、um, Golden Week. And yeah,、uh, we got 20 tickets and 6 banners, so 26 total summons. We'll start from CYL1 and I'll talk about my impressions of the Fade channel while I'm at it because、um, I wasn't too happy about like, my recording yesterday. so And I kind of wasn't really. Too hype about it in general, so I decided against it. So, I guess we'll just go ahead and get started here with CR1. I guess I am gonna go for. I already have plus 10 Brave Land at this point, so I'm not even sure what to do here. <laughs> um, I honestly have no idea. I guess I'll go green? I suppose. <laughs> Maybe in the off chance in the future,、uh, Brave Bike will get. Uh, York's Blessing remixed. <laughs> of all the three five stars I could have gotten, we're gonna get a CYL, <laughs> a CYL one. Oh man. In before, this is the only one I get. <laughs> That's gonna be a little disappointing, but. I mean, whatever, right? He's still like, he's not like unusable, not usable or anything like that, so. I'll shoot for another one, I guess. Yeah, I. I hoarded like a few of them back in the day when Steady Breath was like broken. Um. But I held on to them too long. <laughs> and now Steady Breath is not broken. So. I don't know, maybe I'll just submerge them all up. I think I already did, honestly. I, I don't even remember, man. I don't know what mine's at right now. Maybe he's like plus three or something. But yeah,、uh, Fate Channel, right.、Uh, I guess I'll just go Lucina. Yeah, I wasn't too excited about what we got, but there's potential. Like, the new mode seems potentially interesting, depending how difficult it actually is. But the whole only one unit can, no, not one unit can die, and things like that is pretty cool, honestly.、Um, but I don't know, a lot of PvE modes are generally trivial, so we'll see how it actually goes. Ah,、uh, that was it, right? Alright, CL2. Um. I don't really use Vector much anymore. I think I'll go for Celica's, just because she's my favorite one out of this. Or not. <laughs> I guess we'll go for. I guess we'll go Vector then. I think mine's at plus three currently. Or I'll also take Vanessa's. I'll also take any Vanessa that you want to throw at me, game. But I guess we should go in order. So, Golden Week Celebration. Wow, another no red.、Uh, more of the same stuff. So, nothing too notable there.、Um, and. The remix. Oh, no, no. Next was the Mythic Banner. I don't even remember her name. <laughs> I can't. I don't remember how to pronounce it. What in the world is going on here? You know, I'm gonna go for green, because maybe there is never here, because there's four reads. But. Yeah, we're getting that new Mythic. She's a light Mythic. Which, I don't know, man. I feel like most people have are quite set if they actually care about scoring in AR. I think most of them at this point are set with, like, you know, peonies and whoever, ashes, and all of them good stuff, ask or whatever. I don't even know if people have ask or merch up really. But,、um, finally, I read. So, I don't know how well she's gonna do financially wise, but she is really good for Gale Force comps. And she'll probably be pretty, probably be pretty solid、uh, for combat in general. But that, that C skill is the interesting part.、Um, hold on, let me see. Definitely agree, definitely agree.、Um, yeah, the C skill, unfortunately, it has the Rouse icon. So Rouses are really annoying to use. And Rouse 4 is really bad. <laughs> yeah, with the payoff, was really. <gasps> Oh! We take those. We take those. Oh my gosh. I was just like thinking about the other day how I wanted Party Fighter on、um, my Kel. That is sick. Alright. I'm happy with whatever happens from that one. <laughs> that, is that is amazing. 
Yeah. Um, what was I about the C skill? Yeah. Uh, Rouse Four is really bad, but this one gives Kanto one. I think they said it was. So there's potential there. But still, this, if it still uses a solo setup, it's gonna be really unfortunate. <clears throat> And then we got the Mythic uh, Legendary Remixes and Mythic Remix, I guess, for Lyft. Uh, Lyft got a like special Spiral 4 or something, which and like I think a couple other things. But um, it's really good for its combat, but I, I'm not sold on um, what I do here. Uh, I guess Elliewood, yeah. But as a mythic, unless his weapon has some sort of supported capabilities, I am not sold on how good he's going to be as a defense mythic. Because he's he was already not very great when he came out, and he's just fallen off a cliff. So he needs a lot of help to be useful. If they do some, ooh, if they do something like they did with Thrasir, that could be that could bring him back. Um, yeah, and even Tempest is like joke. <laughs> That's a joke. CYL four. I guess we'll go Dimitri. Yeah, Dimitri. I got a lot of Brave Lucithias like randomly throughout. Um, what, what am I doing? I'm so. <laughs> that's the one I don't want. There's no blue, and I just kind of tunnel vision into green. Oh well. But yeah, I pulled a bunch of random Brave Lucithias of uh, Lucithias over time. Um. Yeah, Lif. Nearly is really gonna. Oh my, come on. I'm not getting like the orbs I want. Um, but Lassithia, I guess, has the second best fodder. Or the best fodder in general. So, out of respawn. Hi, I'm Mia! Um, yeah, so Lip is gonna need a lot of help in that weapon. Uh, and then we got Legendary Edelgard, who got what most of us. Wow, I'm gonna literally getting no uh, blues. She got, I think, what most people expected, where the auto follow condition is much more lenient now. And, but again, she needs some sort of movement skill. So I, I think people are thinking that she's gonna get the flower hot player ability or assault troop in her weapon. Because uh, if she doesn't get that, she's still gonna be really, really not good. So hopefully they do something with that. Yeah, I think she's. I don't think she has slate, does she? Now that I think about it. So that's something she needs to. Uh, okay, that didn't go well, but CYL5. Alright, this is where I have to start thinking if I want to actually pull on the rest of the circle. Um, fodder wise, Marianne would be great. Attack speed unity is fantastic. Yeah, I think I'm gonna go colorless here. I don't think I'm quite. Oh man, I don't think I'm quite going to uh, pull on everything. Uh, all the all the colorless swords on the free plays. Uh, hopefully we get AT. That'd be nice too. But yeah, we'll see w with uh, Edelgard if she's gonna get mobility or not. And um, and then finally the new mode. Yeah, I think I touched up on it earlier. Um, I am cautiously excited for it, and again, it's going to depend how difficult it is, because it's a PvE mode, which are generally not great, uh, difficult, or not great for like people who want a, a challenge. So I don't want to, <laughs> I don't want to sound like <laughs> I'm not sure or anything, but I kind of did. Uh, I guess blue in this case. But yeah, it looks really cool conceptually. It kind of reminds me of the Arkar in the Blue Fantasy, but it's not quite the same. It'll be really funny if <clears throat> they actually do end up monetizing it, as some people mentioned, with like being able to take some of the skills you get end up getting in the new mode. But it is nice how you start with a clean slate. I think it cater it's like more appealing for the type of player who likes the. JRPG kind of aspect of Modern Fire Emblem, where you can just, and since like Awakening, you can just get, grind up your units, get like a million broken skill combinations on them, and be satisfied with that. So I think that appeals to that crowd uh, more than anything. 
So, we'll see how it goes. Um, yeah, I do like how, again, there are kind of stakes to it. I don't know what the deal is with that whole weapon triangle thing. I think they're just doing that to make you, to make it harder on you, rather rather than like easier because you have to be more careful with your units, especially with the colorless stuff going on. So, interesting, interesting mechanic. I'm not sure if I'm, if I'm a fan yet. Uh, yeah, that'll do. And CYL6. Okay, so I pulled two Croms like randomly over the last couple of months, so that's cool. Um, I already have my TP. I think I'm gonna go all red here, and I think I'm gonna pull pull like every red in the circle, maybe, because I really want Clash Fodder. I really, really want Clash Fodder on like at least a couple units. So let's see if we can get lucky with that. <clears throat> I think that covers. Huh, wrong sell up, y'all. Um, I think that covers the whole Golden Week for the most part. I am happy that we got a duo dagger pack because I've never pulled a duo dagger, and as a competitive player, relatively speaking, not having her is kind of a oof. But thankfully, she released during uh, Summoner Duels because now I'm gonna throw her right into one of my teams. Oh, come on. Uh, I'm gonna go colorless because I do like uh, Riga, uh, so this really got Leah by the She's not a great unit, but oh well. Like so many of these, uh, well, not so many, the females here they got <laughs> completely left into the dust so quickly. Like, Tiki got it. Uh, adult Tiki got conquered by Ascended Tiki, and now Rhea is a thing too. Um, and Halloween Corn. Man, it's rough. And Byleth got conquered by Ninja Camilla. And even like Nino. Today and Nino. And even freaking uh, Winter Marth. Alright, can we get the clutch? Final pull for Brave Soul? What? Let's go! Yo! Yo! All right, this is this is amazing! Wow! Um, let's see if he's plus speed actually. Plus defense. Okay, this one's gonna be fodder because this is gonna go straight onto Tsubasa. I've been wanting this on Tsubasa for forever, and we finally got it because she's been stuck on attack speed push four. I was like debating on whether to give her. Um, catch for, but I was like, eh, I'm not sure if it's like super necessary, especially because she wasn't running menace. Um, but catch for now, this is the sauce, so really happy about that. Really happy about that. And like, he doesn't have any other fodder, like, he has lol, but that's not usable on her, so I don't have to feel too bad about like missing out on any other skills. So this is perfect. This is perfect. All right, and that'll do it. Okay, guys, that'll be it for this video. Uh, let me know in the comments how it went for you. Hopefully, it went uh, maybe as, at least as good as mine did. Mine was pretty crazy, guys. I got a Fjorm and a Sella, um, and a bike, I guess. <laughs> but yeah, uh, if you enjoyed this video, leave a like, comment, subscribe, all that stuff. We will be in saving mode, and I guess the next video will be uh, reacting to whatever. Uh, what's her faces? skill set or like exactly what Rouse does and her PRF and whatever so we already know what a weapon does uh probably short but yeah all right see you guys have a good one